the story so far. Arjun is cursed by Urvashi for rejecting her proposal for marriage. While Arjun is still in Indralok, the other Pandavas travel across the country and perform austerities to obtain the grace of gods. The Pandavas moved from one holy spot to another and reached Badrikashram in the Himalayas. Seeing the scenic beauty of the valley, the Pandavas decided to make this their home. One day, a strong wind blew across their settlement carrying petals of lotus. Draupadi, who was gazing at the beauty of the valley, was enchanted by the unearthly smells of the petals. She quickly collected a few petals and asked Bhim to fetch her as many flowers as possible. Bhim gladly agreed to Draupadi's demand and proceeded towards the path marked by the flowers. He traced the path following the scent and soon found himself lost in the thick forest. In an attempt to find his way back, Bhim blew his conch shell causing all animals to wake up. He heard lions roar and felt a sudden tremble on the ground. As he walked ahead to find the source of the trembling, he saw a huge monkey sitting on a rock blocking his way. Bhim had never seen a monkey that was so massive and had a tail so long. Bhim thus paid his respects thinking that the monkey must be a demigod in disguise. He introduced himself as the son of Kunti and Vayu. Having sought his blessings, Bhim asked for permission to leave when the monkey stopped him and chided him for his cruel behavior of waking the animals from sleep. He even stopped Bhim from going ahead. This angered Bhim. Seeing the monkey's impudence, Bhim threatened to move him if he didn't move himself. Bhim's threatening did not seem to affect the monkey. This compelled Bhim to walk ahead and move him out of his path. However, when Bhim tried to lift him, he could not gather enough strength to even move the monkey's tail. The strongest Pandava used both his hands and all his strength to lift the monkey but couldn't move the tail an inch. Having exhausted his energy, Bhim surrendered and asked for forgiveness as he realized that the monkey was more powerful than him. The monkey revealed his true form and introduced himself as Hanuman, Vayu's son and Bhim's brother. Hanuman even graced Bhim with a boon that would help the Pandavas in their fight against the Kauravas. He told him that in war, Hanuman will instill fear in the hearts of the enemy and give new life to the Pandava army. Having said these words, the brothers embraced each other and parted ways. Indra embraced Arjun and asked him not to be afraid of the curse as it will befall him in the final year of his exile.